Hey guys, welcome back to Roch Nara's world. So guys, uh, today's video we will be discussing end-to-end -end questions of Cognizant Gen Z developer profile. So there was a candidate who cracked this interview uh, who was from, uh, you know, B.Tech Computer Science and Engineering, uh, you know, background uh, for the batch of 2021 batch pass outs. So let's discuss in details what all questions were asked by, uh, by the interviewer to him and how uh, uh, he uh, answered those questions basically so let's discuss in details so basically this interview um, I mean went approximately uh, till I mean 40 45 minutes the interview uh, lasted for this particular candidate so the first question which they asked was to introduce yourself fine uh, then the next questions uh, question which was asked uh, was uh, describe your project um, I mean uh, his project mainly uh, you know was based on the machine learning project a lot of cross questioning happened uh, from this project based uh, you know question I mean how was your project why did you choose this project uh, and how what kind of you know uh, problem you faced in this project how did it help uh, you uh, to do this project a lot of like questions basic questions from the project were asked then the next question was asked was that uh, language which you are comfortable with so the candidate asked uh, I mean the candidate informed that uh, he is comfortable in Python C and Java so now uh, based on this particular question I mean this uh, language question there were further questions being asked uh, from him based on uh, these were very basic questions uh, you should know you should prepare these questions I mean the basic concepts uh, were you know checked by the interviewer uh, by asking these concepts questions so like the questions are class and objects so you'll get uh, you uh, I won't uh, I mean give the answers to the questions here why because I want you to guys to check google it go through it and prepare basic uh, you know um, uh, meaning of these questions I mean meaning of these uh, you know terms so basically it was like what is class and object then oops concept like inheritance uh, polymorphism uh, then uh, you have they ask data abstraction and in uh, capsulation uh, you know based questions they asked I mean the mean I mean they asked uh, what is I mean the meaning of these then basically difference between method uh, overload or method uh, sorry method overloading or overriding then uh, what is abstraction and what is static keyword and static method they asked what is final keyword what is break and continue they asked further then what is pass in python so they asked questions from python questions from you know c and java uh, as well from him so difference between list and map difference between list and uh, tuple then what is monkey uh, patching what is thread what is data structure and its types they asked then the next question they asked was linked list and different bit between array and linked list then different a difference between uh, truncate and delete so these were approximately you know for 20 uh, 25 questions approximately they asked these were the questions actually he remembered but yes the um, I mean there are a lot of uh, questions are being covered in this particular uh, you know experience uh, they also asked to execute codes now uh, uh, there were two questions here one was the swap to number without using any third variable they asked and then find duplicate element from the list these were the basic questions uh, asked for from coding section uh, I mean coding uh, topic then the last question was SQL query to write a query uh, I mean of third highest salary without using limit was one of the question and the second uh, question which they asked was write a query to find your name in the employees name table uh, which uh, they need uh, to run a query in SQL so the these were the questions you can pause it and you can write down these questions uh, so that you can prepare these questions for a cognizant density developer profile so this interview I mean uh, took almost uh, one hour so guys yes you have to prepare very well I mean if your concepts are being clear uh, your uh, basics are being clear then which is very uh, you know interview goes very well so this was the interview experience from one of the candidate I wanted to share with you I hope this helps guys and yeah do uh, you know subscribe to the channel for the latest updates guys uh, I will try to come up with Tech Mahindra video uh, and I am also planning to get a Wipro video for you people uh, so yeah do subscribe the channel for these updates till then guys uh, do share with your friends and uh, till then bye have a great day be safe take care